Because in that scene when, when they make out, that is when Jennifer reveals to Needy like what actually happened with mm-hmm. Low Shoulder and with the sacrifice. And I really wanted to talk about that too because um, I mean I think that scene is very, very important and there's there's a lot I want to talk about. The placement of the scene in mm-hmm. the movie mm-hmm. um, by I haven't really talked much about Karen Kusama, who's the director of this movie. But the, the choice to put that scene where it is in the movie, I think, is really important and, for me, does a lot for making this movie a standout and very, very different from most other horror movies it's referencing, especially Evil Dead, the one it's referencing the most directly most of the time, I think. But this the placement of that scene where we already know that Jennifer, in a, in a way, survived it, right? Like, she might technically be dead, but she's she's still living. So we have this scene where she gets really violently murdered, but in no point when you're watching that scene do you actually have to worry about Jennifer dying in that scene because you know that she already came back. And so many lesser horror movies rely so much on that really cheap writing of just putting a woman in danger and that being the only tension in the scene. And yeah, this... I'm. Definitely talking about Evil Dead without directly talking about Evil Dead. Sorry if you really love Evil Dead. I don't want to fight. You can love it. Um, but this is my issue with it in general. Yeah. yeah um, that's how I felt about it, too. Mm-hmm. And that's often when I really don't like a horror movie. It's because of that. Because it over relies on, we're just going to put this woman in danger even if it doesn't really serve the greater story mm-hmm. at all. Because... It's the easiest way to get a scare in, and audiences sort of expect it, and they expect to see, like, boobs Mm -hmm. (laughs) during a sacrifice Mm -hmm. scene, usually. But this was something different because of where it was placed in the movie. I I just really love that choice to put it there, where we don't have to worry about her, you know, we know, I know that she actually dies, but um, we don't really have to worry about whether or not we're going to see her again 